I don't know how to tell my parents. I don't know how to say it. Like you didn't think about all those things before you start before you start doing it. What? I never thought this would ever happen to me. Like ever. TQS bonnets, TQS bonnets, the bonnets that hold magic all on its own. Get yours at www.tqsbooth.com. So I have an announcement, and like I don't know if it's a good or a bad announcement, and I don't know how I'm gonna tell my parents, but I don't know. I I just feel like. My parents won't be really happy about it. Honestly, I don't know how I feel. I don't know if I'm like happy or like sad. Cause it's not a good thing, especially for my age, but it's a blessing. But it's not like a good thing. And honestly, I don't know how to say this or put this into words, but um, I'm just scared to like know my parents' reaction. Like I don't, especially my dad, because my dad is super strict, and like he's gonna be really mad. Like he's gonna be really mad. Like I never expected this to happen to me, but I think I'm pregnant. Honestly, this is like overwhelming, and like it's quite sad because like. Everything's gonna change. Like my life is gonna change. Like school's gonna be harder, and I don't want to turn up to school as like a belly bump. And honestly, I don't think like I don't want to get rid of it because like I don't want to. And I don't know how my parents are gonna feel about that. Honestly, like I know my dad's gonna be mad, but I don't know like how my mom is gonna feel. And I really don't want to tell them because obviously I'm gonna get in trouble. But uh, at the same time, yeah, like, they have to know because I cannot provide for myself and, like, my child. And honestly, I don't know how to feel. Like, I'm, like, so confused and so lost. This is, like, super, super scary for me. Like, I don't want to think about it. But then at the same time, I have to think about it because... If I don't tell my parents now, they're going to see it for themselves because the baby bump is going to start to develop and I can't hide my whole pregnancy. But then if I tell my parents now, I'm going to have to face the consequences now and I'm not ready to face the consequences now. But at the same time, if they see the belly bump, they might like take it lightly because it it's just like just there, like it just happened. And it's super scary to think about like i don't like i don't know how to tell my parents i don't know how to say it like this is pressure and my dad is literally home like it's gonna be chaos and i'm not ready for that like i'm too tired i just like finished my exams and like i have to face this and mm -mm, like i'm i don't know honestly but maybe my mom it's going to be so much more lenient with it compared to my dad. But like, also with me, like I'm not ready to be a mother because I have like life to live. And like, I do need to like experience childhood. Like my childhood isn't over yet. And I never pictured my life with a child at such a young age. But then at the same time, I don't want to get rid of the child because it is my fault in the first place. And I just don't want to go, oh, like, I'm not going to feel so guilty if I do so. And it's just a long process, to be honest. I just don't really want to do that in the first place. Like, I don't know. I actually don't know what to say right now. I am speechless. Like. I'm like trying to process this whole thing, like everything and what will happen. Like I'm literally thinking to the future. I'm thinking through the future and it's so scary. Like who knows what's gonna happen at an hour later. Like, you know, it's just like really scary really like a scary thought and i honestly i never thought this would ever happen to me like ever like me being pregnant that's 
not what I thought would ever happen. Like I never pictured this for myself, but here I am, pregnant. I I actually don't know what to say. This is so like scary. Oh, like I'm just like I'm actually thinking like me with a child while my friends and people the same age as me are just like you know living their life having fun you know going to uni but then all of these opportunities are gonna be blocked for me because like i have a child to take care of and i might have to get a job as well and this is just like so stressful to think like, I don't, I have to tell my parents. I know I have to tell my parents. Like, I just have to tell my parents. If I don't tell my parents, then who else am I going to tell, you know? And my parents are the ones who they just provide for me. And they're going to have to provide for the child, right? So, like, I don't know how this is going to work. Because my parents are so strict. I just don't want to think about it. But I have to think about it. I just, like... I don't know. I just honestly, I don't know what to say to myself. I'm so like disappointed in myself. And I know my parents are gonna be so disappointed in me. So that's gonna be even more worse. But I'm gonna have to face it, you know. I'm gonna have to face it because it just is what it is. Just have to face life, you know. <laughs> I have to face the consequences. I have to face everything and you know I have to be prepared like I have no choice and you know it just happen and I have no choice and, you know things do happen and it was a mistake and you know obviously I'm gonna learn from this mistake and you know things happen in life for a reason obviously this happened for a reason and you know we sometimes we just don't know why but i'm just gonna have to face it and tell my dad i just don't want to tell my dad like a hundred percent don't want to tell my dad but i have to tell my dad that i don't want to tell my dad this is like the scariest thing ever oh, this is so scary this this is so scary, honest. I don't know what to say to myself. Like, I don't know what to say. I do not know what to say and what to think of right now. So, like, you guys already know how, like, my parents are, like, super strict and, like, they're Nigerian parents, of course. And, you know, it's really hard to tell them things, especially, like, pregnancy and stuff. And, like, yeah. And also... Honestly, the reason why I'm recording this is because I just like want to show it to them instead of saying it to them face to face. So just in case mom and dad you're asking why are you recording this instead of telling me. Well, I'm recording because I'm too nervous to tell you guys and it's too scary to tell you guys about this. So it's probably so much easier for you guys to just find out for the video. Um, yeah, like honestly this is not a joke like pregnancy is not a joke and i just i don't know how i'm gonna deal with this you know i don't know how i'm gonna go through this on my own and i don't know if i'm gonna be supported by my boyfriend anyway because he's young and he doesn't he's like a recluse he doesn't really care about stuff like that you know like i'm gonna be like single I'm gonna be like a single mother and I'm just gonna raise my kids by myself and I just don't know my kid like like imagine if it comes out as twins as well like that's gonna be kids and I've always wanted like twins I just don't want to be pregnant because like I'm too yeah, I'll show you. nothing what are you talking about myself yourself yeah I had your conversation with someone no, I'm talking to myself. Talking to yourself? Yeah. What did they have? Nothing. It's just like a reflection. So what? A reflection. A reflection of what? Myself. I'm just talking to myself. Like I like to talk to myself a lot. I heard about I heard about it the one you were saying. You what? I heard what you were saying. I didn't say anything. Eh? I didn't
say anything. Mm -hmm. You didn't say anything? Yeah, I just thought it was all about what, what is the thing of coming and I start talking to someone? I'm talking about school. I'm recording. It's not video. about school. I don't have a school. Uh, it's a video. I'm talking about school. You had this thing for me. So I had a good day in school. Are you having anything for me? No. I had a good day in school and I crossed no, the road. No, 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 no. Don't put a joke with me, okay? I crossed the road and I got on the train and I got home. The end. Bye, guys. What is bad girl? What's wrong? What, yeah. what are you talking about? Nothing. You're in front of the camera and you start saying something. I'm not saying anything. You're talking about school. Yeah, I'm talking about school. You, I didn't hear it about school. What did you hear? I just want to say it. Say what? I had a good day in school. Like. Hey, hey, it's not a life matter. You just have to talk to you. Who not to me? I had a good day in school. Okay. Alia, you know, in this house, you never lied to me. Mm -hmm. Even though your sister never lied to me. Mm -hmm. There was so much. Why, why, why are you changing everything? I had a good day in school. The good day in school? What? I just. Being in front of the camera, I have to tell people about the good day in school? Yeah. I'm not gonna post this. I'm just making a video for myself. I just want to see it. Like, you know, maybe like when I'm older, I just want to see myself tell myself that I have a good day. No, I'm a girl. Yeah. I just want to see what you will say to your friends or I don't know what myself, you're talking about. Myself. Or what you have video about. No? Cool. Just tell them everything. I'm the best to help you out. I had a very good day in school today. Well, I want to say is that, like, I'm not to say it, to be honest. Um, I'm pregnant. You are pregnant. I'm pregnant. Are you serious? No. You, are you serious? No. Do you I'm know what you are saying? Do you know what pregnant is? I'm just like we, I don't know. We have a child. When 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 is that? Huh? When? I don't know. You don't know. Do you have a boyfriend? Dad, you know about this. I don't know about that. Yeah. Do you ever come to me and tell me that you have a boyfriend? I should not know about that. You said not to, but I said I would. Sorry. You said not to, and I said I would. Not to? When was that? I don't know. You know, it's the party that had a boyfriend. Especially when you, are, when you are going to school. Don't you just see what just happened to you now? Are you going to think about your education? Uh, are you going to think about your life? I was thinking, like, I'll probably, like, get homeschooled or something. Get homeschooled? Yeah. I just, I don't think it's appropriate to go to school right now. You don't want to go to school. You don't want to go to school or what? You don't know. You go back to you go to school with your pregnancy. Then people are going to see you. How you how how, how you look like. You gonna take the shame. It's not me gonna take the shame. Your mom is gonna take you're not gonna take shame. Do you understand me? Before you start doing this, what can't you think about about, about the about the problem that's gonna come out for you? You are highly disappointed on me. I'm disappointed on you, actually. This is not what I applied for you. It was an accident. I said, what? Just look at the result. It's not to a boyfriend. When you start choosing a boyfriend, this is going to come out from it. You don't think about your life. You don't think about your, the family. Then you are being a total disgrace into this family. Do you understand me? Does your mother know about it? Then your mother didn't know about it. Then you come from in front of the camera, start talking. Gonna, to who? I'm just gonna show you the video. Like I don't wanna tell you. You're gonna show me the video? Yeah. Is that gonna help you out? Why can't you just come to me direct and start telling me all those stuff? Because I was scared, like scared what? So you get mad at me. Man are you? You're mad at you now? Yeah. It's not me, it's you. It's a disgrace. And you disappoint me about everything I've done. All, all I plan for you to, to go through. Now tell me what you're going to do. Jump out. Jump out. Work at McDonald's. Work at McDonald's. Oh, you are choosing very good things. They, they will jump, jump, um, jump out. Work at McDonald's. That is, they you pack your room and get your own house too. Is that right? Does that sound good? No. Then I'm gonna tell you more. No, Dad, please don't tell her more. Why? Because she had she had to know. I know, but she will just watch the video. 
No, no, no. I'm, I'm going I'm to tell your mom. Yeah, you can tell mom. I'm not like that. Yeah, I will tell your mom. Yeah, yeah. I'll... I don't have I don't have anything for her. But you can... And this 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 situation, I don't need to have anything for her. You can you can tell her when I'm not here. No, you be there. I'm taking you down there. Okay? You be there. They, you didn't think about all those things before you start before you start doing it. Huh? So when I sent you to school, uh -huh. when do you when do you see the boy? Who is the boy? Oh, when? I don't know. You don't know. You don't know. When do you start seeing the boy? And where is the boy walking? Is he a student or what? A student. A student. It's my age. It's your age. The, you think the boy can take care of you? It doesn't work. It doesn't work? No. That's a big problem. Then the boy has to drop out too. He doesn't want to. He doesn't want to. Do you want to drop out? He doesn't want to. I go to feed the baby. I go to close the baby. You can help me. I can help you. You just think that. You think I can help you. That's the reason you went forward to do all those stuff. You don't think about the problem that's going to come out from it. Yeah? I want to see the boy. Give me the boy number. I'm going to call him. I just want to see him. You can't press it, 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 it look, how it look like. It's 35. Say what? It's 35. 35? 35. What? That's the break out! <laughs> what do you mean by surprise? It's a break. I'm actually pregnant. Well, I'm actually pregnant. Don't you be before the camera start talking. <laughs> I knew you were going to come. <laughs> I don't believe you. 35. <laughs> what's so funny about it? No, he's 56. I'm joking. It's a break, I promise. <laughs> You go for nothing. I'm gonna tell your mom. No, mom, it's a prank. I'm gonna tell, but I, I, I don't know. I, 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 I need to go back to school. What's the prank? But I, 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 I heard you what, what everything you were saying. You know you have the reason to stop me when I'm sleeping. I don't want to prank you. <laughs> want to prank me? Yeah. I feel like I should get like an extra Christmas present for successfully pranking you. Ah, uh, Christmas present. So guys, obviously I successfully pranked my dad. He fell for it. He actually thought I was pregnant. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. I successfully pranked my dad. Of course I am not pregnant. I'm 16. Like, what? We're out. Peace. Hey. Hey. Hey.